Hi, everyone. Happy Friday. I'm thinking today about forgiveness. It was C.S. Lewis who said this in Mere Christianity. He said, everybody thinks forgiveness is a lovely idea. That is until they have something to forgive. Isn't that true? Forgiveness is something that we all love to receive, and yet sometimes it's very difficult to give it away when we ourselves have been hurt. You know, in the Lord's Prayer, we pray this often, forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Literally rendering that in the Greek means that we are asking God to forgive to us the same amount that we ourselves are offering to others. Ever since I've learned that, I've never prayed that line the same since. Because forgiveness can be difficult. It can be challenging, especially when we have been hurt deeply. And yet, when we stop and consider how we ourselves have hurt God with our sins and with the things that we have done and the things that we have left undone, we realize the greatness of forgiveness that God offers to us. And so we take an opportunity this weekend, and can I challenge you this weekend to consider a little bit more about forgiveness with me? Where are those places that we need to forgive and to release any kinds of thoughts of someone owing us something? Where can we forgive that, and where can we place that into the hands of God in the case of those who haven't asked for it yet, but simply offer it to God and say, God, when they're ready, grant that forgiveness to them. So, you know, as we go before the Lord in prayer and go into this weekend, let's join together in that very prayer. Let's pray. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen.